Okay, another point about the third. If in fact we take a certain kind of seventh chord and the third stays the same, but the seventh is a half step below what it would be in the major scale, we have a dominant seventh chord. So this means that the seventh changed, but the third stayed constant. So the, se- the third is important here because even if the seventh changes, the third is still going to give it a semi major sound. <laughs> If we lower that, however, we get a a minor seventh sound. Major third, minor seventh. Minor third, minor seventh, which gives us a full minor seventh chord. So you see, to elaborate on the third in this respect is also really important.